We all know Stephen Curry is one of the greatest all-time players and the greatest shooter ever, with the silkiest jump shot ever to be seen in the NBA. He's a three-time NBA champion, two-time most valuable player, seven-time All-Star, two-time All-Star three-point contest winner. He's very short for an NBA player, standing only at six foot three inches. Steph's 2016-17 Warriors team is often picked to be the best official roster ever. The starters of Steph at point guard, Clay Thompson at shooting guard, Kevin Durant at small forward, Draymond Green at power forward, and Boogie, aka Marcus Cousins at center. They also have Andre Iguodala, or AI2, as their six man. They're looking for to Draymond Green, of course, his boy. Here, caught them game clock. Curry. Working against none. Let's the three go. Scores it! Stop! With a huge dagger! Shooting night, Mark. Five for 23 from the field. The question is, how many shots did he miss when it matters most? Yeah. Number two, Joel Embiid. Joel Embiid's 76ers this year are the number one in their conference. They have a big three of himself, Ben Simmons, and Tobias Harris. Joel Embiid's awards include a runner-up for MVP this year, two-time All-NBA team, two-time All-NBA defensive team, and one-time All-NBA rookie team. Number one, my favorite player, Draymond Green. Draymond Green is the Dennis Rodman of today. He's a double-double and triple-double machine and an amazing defensive player. He plays power forward even though he's only six foot six which is very small for that position. Not only is Draymond Green a great defensive player, but he's also a one-time DPOY. Draymond Green has also made the NBA All-Team twice in his career. He's also made the All-NBA Defensive Team at least four times. He's made the All-Star roster three times. Also consider Draymond one of the best two defensive players we've ever had on the Warriors and at least one of the top 10 best lockdown defenders of all time. Number four. Irvin Magic Johnson. Magic Johnson is in most true basketball fans a top 10 of the all-time GOATs. Him and Kareem were a massive dynamic duo and dominated the league. The best passer and the all-time leading scorer, Mr. Goggles, 1991. Magic Johnson is at the height of his career, but then it all ended when he revealed his positive HIV test only days after he announced his retirement. Later, he came back to play in an All-Star game in which he won MVP. After and during his career, he ended up donating over $25 million to HIV studies and related matters.
Number three, Mr. Jalen Brown. Jalen Brown is a star in today's NBA. Any roster would be happy to have him. He's a good offensive player and a pretty solid defensive player. He's a civil rights activist and has worked with organizations such as No Books, No Ball, established 1991, and the Boys and Girls Club of Boston. Jalen said, just by using my platform, being an athlete, a basketball player, I think it has a lot of influence. I'm just trying to use it in a positive manner. Buries it. Wow. I mean, that's right to left to the step back. LeBron James at number two. All right, we all know LeBron James. He's the second greatest player of all time. And if you haven't heard of his name, um, that sucks for you. Anyway, being the second greatest player of all time, he has therefore made hundreds of million dollars and mostly not let the fame go to his head. Anyway, he created the LeBron James Family Foundation which donates money to several charities such as the Boys and Girls Club of America, After School All-Stars, the Children's Defense Club, and so on. My point being, LeBron is a cool guy. So congratulations to LeBron James, the 2008-2009 NBA Most Valuable Player.